Good morning. It's Rosalie with Can't Wait to Plan. How you guys doing? I hope you're having, you had a wonderful weekend or week so far. Um, so let me see. So today I'm bringing you a, um, what do you call that when it's combined, uh, a collective haul. Um, these, some of these I've gotten a while back and it's just a few things here and there and it doesn't really fit into anything. So I sort of left it, but most of it is paper crafting collection kits. I love those. I, I think I'm addicted. I don't know. But anyway, so I will try to remember, I think some of them I even wrote it down, um, where I got it and how much I pay for it. So, um, I got from eBay, I got a um, a couple of collection kits from Bow Bunny. Uh, one of them I've been looking for, so that I was so happy to find that. This one I wasn't looking for it, but I really like the the paper. So I um, this is kind of an older collection of um, a newer one that they have called Family Heirloom. This is called Once Upon a Lifetime, and it's sort of that that same feel to it, which is like family memories and family scrapbooking and things like that and i pay uh, most bow bunny collection kits are 19 dollars. i pay 13.50 for it so here's i think you can see but anyway um so you get i believe you just get one no let me see you get two you get two of each paper so here's i'll go far away from here first and then i'll go closer up and this one is just called once in a lifetime the name of the collection as well as the name of the paper this one look how cute that is this one is called ancestors and it just have a bunch of of um, family tree stuff family tree information which is i thought was really cute that's the back this one is called this this covers and this kind of a little bit um um, what do you call it? Uh, pale or whatever muted. Oh, I love the polka dots on this side. And so on. And this one, I think it's called family tree because it is a family tree. Now, I don't love this tree. It's a little bit, I don't know, a little bit uh, scary looking <laughs> to me. So, oh, I love this side. So that's good. So I'm going to use the wood side. I love this side. This is called generations. And interesting how it has a little bit, it looked like, it covers, you know, this polka dot, but it's like these little thing that covers some writing or whatever. Oh, but look how pretty this side is. It's sort of a cut apart page. And, oh, oh, it has two, two, two of them. So, okay, I can use the other one for the back. And that one is called Generations. And this one is called Grandparents. As you can tell, I put the name of the paper in alphabetical order for you this is a blue brick wall very pretty this one is called namesake and it's a little boring okay so this side is cuter but still very plain but i like it um and this one is called relatives it's a bunch of vertical borders or actually you could use it any way you want and in the back it's a very similar blue to match some of these. You now you could use it that way or whatever. And yeah. And then this one is another sort of frame cut apart. I like this a lot, this side called Traditions. And then the a brick. Oh, I like the brick wall too. Okay. So then it repeats. Okay. So you get two of each. And then the collection kit, you also get. One of the sticker sheets they call the bobani call them combo stickers you always get um the alphas which is i think kind of nice and then the stickers with it it's just single-sided so anyway and then this one i have some of it already i bought it before from another um ebay um what do you call it sellers but she only had in, no, you know what? I think whatever it was, I only had in individual paper, but I didn't. I couldn't get the whole collection, and I really, really like the happy colors of this one. This one I also pay a um, no. This one you have extra beside the collection kit, so I pay thirteen fifty for it. And it is so. Isn't it so cute? It's called Summer Mood. It's a it's a summer with kind of a more pastel-y colors. And look how gorgeous so um 
again you get two of each paper this one is just the first one's always just the name of the collection which is called summer mood and then there's some awards here but i love this side and then this one is called beat the heat super duper cute three by four cut apart i'm glad the back is nothing to write home about and this one is called dots <laughs> that's what it is oh i like this one almost look like um curtains like at a theater you know like a fancy theater and so on this one i guess first squeeze okay and then this one got some loopy loop <coughs> this side is gonna be used let's go this is so pretty just got some i don't know what kind of shape you would call that but and then the, oh i like that one it's called let's Ex let's go explore love that and i always love typewriter i love i'm addicted to typewriters um uh, old typewriters cameras as well as houses images so and you know sort of like if some collection have that i have to get it so crazy are you guys like you know particular about this is so cute it's called perfection that's what it is some gorgeous, gorgeous popsicle. Are you like that to certain images or icon? Let me know down below if if um, if you have sort of a particular thing that you absolutely cannot resist. Um, I know some of my friends who sometime watch this. This is called Spontaneous, by the way. That looked like a fruit in Vietnam that, that I know you think it's slices of lemon or lime or whatever, but there's a fruit in Vietnam. It, it sort of stick up like that. It's white on the inside and purple on the outside. I can't remember what it's called. It is absolutely delicious. There's a seed, one big seed on the inside, and, and then you just scoop it out with a spoon and that looks just like it because the coloring is very similar um yeah uh one of my friends the uh miss nicole from Vag vagabond crafter she is she loves pigs mainly because her her son loves pigs this is so cute i love these cut apart but uh, and they're both addicted to disney by the way that was called sweet is the name of the paper this is oh okay so then it repeats i was gonna say what happened um okay and then this is oh my gosh look how gorgeous this sticker sheet is you got oh they gotta gotta make uh scan this so i can make more of these the beautiful typewriters you got the borders of the popsicles and so on i don't you love this color doesn't it make you so happy okay so that came with this whole um they call them noteworthy which is for them is their their um, ephemera um section the ephemera set and bobani tend to make their ephemera at least back then very huge okay so i took them out just so you can kind of tell what um what the thing looked like and look at that i mean <laughs> that's gonna be a title of some sort because or you know actually no you could you could um put a photo in there but anyway it's a lot of humongous but i like big so for me it's okay but for some of you you may have some challenges with that okay so that's um board number one and then you have a second one also so it's not a huge number of ephemera but they're larger so i really like that and i'm glad i got another oh and we got the um the globe on that too and i love these these are easy to copy and make more if you want to make like a whole feel of it or not feel but you know line the bottom or something and then um she gave she gave um she put it in the that's why it's 18 dollars, and you can see that these are called layered chipboard beautiful for the collection this does not be is part of the collection but she threw it in just to make it more i don't think this was part of the collection either but it works because it has all the cute pink and the polka dot and then she threw this in so you know just to make kind of like a, a um, bigger uh, kit to be worth the 25 dollars or whatever um, 18 dollars so anyway that's perfect love 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 Okay, then I picked this up. 
I've been looking for this collection forever. So if any of you um, love Ciabella's, which is a uh, paper manufacturer from Italy, and this is a slightly older collection. I don't know what year it is from, but it's called Microcosmos. And um, it's not that old, but it's probably two, three years old. And this was before I came back to scrapbooking, so I did not have it. But when I saw it um, here and there from different videos or whatever, Pinterest or something, I loved it, but I wasn't able to find it. I found some people, uh, some um, stores, uh, retail stores or online stores from Europe, like some weird, not weird country. It's not like um, England or something. It's like some other one. Yugoslavia or something like that but they had they had one of these but it's like so and it's not expensive but it's like how can I order it anyway um so but I found this which is the pattern pad which is basically the background um paper pad or collection kit that support the collection so it's not the main collection but it support the collection and actually the images are just as stunning and I found that from HSN it was not I can't remember what, how much I paid. I forgot to look it up for you, but it wasn't a, a lot and it wasn't cheap, but it wasn't a lot. I think it might have been, I don't know, $13, $14 or something like that. And I loved it. So I should have even got two because you only get one paper with each. And now I think it's sold out, but look how pretty. These are, I think, are some of the the um, main paper in the in the main collection kit. And this one is called the Pattern Collection Kit. So you got the month over there, but if you don't need that, then you can use these blank ones, which is perfect for journaling or whatever. And then look how cute. It is look cute. Let's see the cute little lady buggy. Oh my gosh. And even the ants looks good in here, even though we hate them in person. And it's, isn't that stunning? Oh my gosh, I love it. And then these gorgeous, gorgeous cut apart right look at that butterfly and that dragonfly oh my gosh so pretty and that the butterfly paper look at the hidden hummingbird kind of in between all the flowers can you find them you know the the game where's waldo yep it's like you look quickly you don't you don't see them but there they are That's so pretty oh this side is so pretty too shoot and then um you get, yeah, with the pattern patch, you only get eight sheet of paper. That's why they're also a little bit cheaper too. And let's look at these clocks. Stunning too. This is beautiful. Oh, okay, now I gotta go find another one of these. I didn't even look at it when I when I got it. And yes, I was gonna do it with you guys. Look how gorgeous that is. Oh my God, right? Okay you find it please let me know and or just buy it for me i'll pay you back um and then oh i forgot to look at these up so then recently remember how um i got the um uh what was it uh, the minte collection from an etsy sellers called artisan boutique by tpa well she had a bunch of um she carried also craft o'clock which is a um a um what do you call it? A, a manu paper manufacturers or, or a scrapbooking manufacturer from Poland. And she had these, she didn't have, she didn't have the, um, the collection itself, but she, maybe she did, but it sold out, but they, she had these and I actually love these. You know how much I love fussy cutting and cutting out, um, ephemera and things. I don't know why, because I have so many. There's, I mean, literally I will, I will be buried with my die cuts, <laughs> okay. But anyway, isn't that gorgeous? It's just images of homes, I mean, of things in the house and stuff. And this one is called Afternoon Walk. So I look it up, I'll look it up and find out what the collection looked like and so on. But look, there's just a little, cute little, it look almost like a, a little suitcase, but it has feet. So I don't think it's a suitcase. But anyway, even the Vespa, we used to write that a lot in Vietnam where I'm from and so on gorgeous and then here's oh this look like greece huh that look like greece and then again with um this and other um company like um Chalbella does the same thing stamperia does the same thing their um uh, die cut 
the booklet, they're the same images on both sides. It's just oriented the other way. So here's the first paper. Look how cute. I love that. You see, it's such a nice display. Little kids should put stuff inside. Beautiful. And then the back is the same. You just, this makes it even easier to die cut, right? They make the thing gray. So you can just zip, 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 and so on. This one is, uh, wait, this, wait a minute. Oh, you get two each. Oh, awesome. You get two each, okay, for the for these. Whereas the other, the Stamperia and stuff, you only get one. Okay, again, you know, lemon stuff, all the stuff for home. Remember, I got the one from Stamperia called Welcome Home. That's, oh, sorry, I did the bottom really fast. That's, this, this remind me of that too, because it's just of things you find in the house and, you know, little rattan chair for your front door and stuff like that okay and then oh then now you have a little bit of a summer theme thingy going on here you got oh look at that old camera and some more lemon stuff and then the back is the same then you have a, the a sheet of floral now these floor is a little bit small that's gonna be a little hard to fussy cut out but I will manage. Okay, this makes it a little bit easier, right? Yeah, that's why they do it this way. And this one is a little bit bigger, but again, this would be a lot easier on this side to cut out. Excellent. Oh my gosh. And then she had a couple others. And again, I, I meant to, but I forgot to look it up to see what the actual collection looked like. And I'll show you in a second. It's a different manufacturer. Um, and then this one I got from, again, I think it's an Etsy seller. It was a while ago, and I don't even remember how much I paid. It wasn't expensive because Craft O'Clock only gives you six pieces of paper. <laughs> so I think it was like eight, seven dollars or something like that. So you may want to get two just because it has so few paper. Okay, and then in the back of the front cover, you have these um, die cut that you can cut out, tags mostly. And then this is the gorgeous paper. And I love, look, the, the, I mean, this just pops, right? You have the beautiful kind of monotone. It's not really gray. It's kind of like that taupey, antique look. And then um, with a ballet dancer sitting in the corner, that's actually beautiful. And But look at the pop of yellows everywhere. Oh my gosh, isn't that make you so happy? And then the back of this one. Now these, they don't have names either. They just say page number one, two, and three and stuff like that. So gorgeous. And then you have this. Now I can cover the, the cute, but I don't do anything with horses. I may need to cover him up, but he's he's cute. I can have a picture coming out of it, covering him, but still use the, the floral from it. There's that. Oh gosh, this page is gorgeous. Look at all that peeling wood and stuff. And then look how pretty this one is. I don't know what kind of flower this is, but it looks very tropical-y, right? And very grungy on this side. Oh, this is pretty. To, um, I, what does it say? I am happy just to dance with you. Aww. I don't know that song, I don't think. I have to look it up. Oh, by the way, this is called Force of Gentleness. Is the, isn't that gorgeous? Look at that ballet dancers. As you know, my daughter is a ballet girl for a long time until recently when she joined the back. is gorgeous too. Um, when she joined the, her high school dance team. So now she doesn't really have time to do much of the ballet anymore, but um, beautiful. And then here's some more flowers, tropical, more like, and that's it. That's the force of gentleness. And then the um, other collection from Craft O'Clock. And I got this because I wanted to have a few paper. I don't have a whole lot that is like, you know, a little bit with the Asian feel to it. And because I'm Asian, I'm from Vietnam. And so this is very more, I think, more Japanese um, inspired, but that's fine. We have a lot of Japanese friends and we love sushi, and um, which happened to be my dog's name too. <coughs> <coughs> Look how pretty. 
even have warriors um images you see oh no that's that's an umbrella i thought it was a a sword behind her doesn't that look like a sword i didn't see that part and i thought it was a sword behind her back have you guys seen the movie a crouching tiger jumping leaping something or another crunching tiger or a crouching tiger it's i know that one part of it is is something crouching tiger but i can't remember the other one they just re-release it and it is such oh my god the actress in there she is absolutely stunning she looks like she's about 12 but she's not um asian people tend to look much younger when they're you know in in the early part of their life actually they always look younger um this is pretty just so the other one was kind of taupey and yellow this one is kind of darker taupe black and red and you know those three colors look at this beautiful like a low shallow waterfall sort of uh or river or whatever and then these cherry blossoms ah oh, stunning um if you haven't seen it, see it. It is just so good. You know, I know it's subtitled. Movies can be kind of a pain sometimes, but it's worth it. And um, she's stunning, and she she's a she play a blind girl who um, is just an amazing warrior and an amazing dancer too. Um, but anyway, a really special Chinese dance that you have to watch to to believe it's. It's um, with drums and oh, that 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 scene is one of my favorite in the whole movie. It's towards the beginning of the movie, and I'm sure it's stream. It got to be streaming on Netflix or something. But um, really, really, really stunning, gorgeous, but also um, very good movie storyline too. So that is uh, what did I painted by the wind is the name of the collection. So pretty. And then this one I got recently too, I believe from Artisan Boutique as well. I saw this collection from somewhere, I don't know where, but um, I could not find it anywhere because it's older. It's um, also from Craft O'Clock. It's called Seaside Greetings. And the only thing I can find was an eight by eight. So I'm gonna live with that. But I, the, the paper I saw was this and that's all I wanted. <laughs> so, so I had to buy it, but <coughs> it cut these in two. What is this? Uh, four by four? Four by four. Seems so tiny for a four by four, but I guess it is, huh? Anyway, you can. That's, that's That does not sound. Look, yeah, I guess so. And then look how stunning the paper is. And I think you get two of each set of 24 double sided paper, 24 papers. So maybe you get three of each. Okay, so here's the first one it is so gorgeous just can you like oh my gosh so pretty okay this side I, I can do without but look even this it's like a beautiful lighthouse that abandoned ship and the gorgeous background and a little bit under the sea and the gorgeous is it peony or whatever oh my gosh that's stunning with chip lap or whatever that's the one i wanted so badly isn't that so cute look at it even have the the little um life preserve or whatever you call it they don't look like outhouse but i guess they are i'm not sure what they are this is a lifeguard but these look like outhouse <laughs> that's funny that's really pretty if it they're really outhouse that you where you go you go to the bathroom or something oh that's so cool looking like stucco almost like that and then it repeats yeah so you get three sets no you get four sets of each you only get six paper oh yeah we said they only have six paper and and then the um the front the front you get the these uh cut out thing that's it so you get four of each awesome okay so then I got these two I absolutely love so much. Crap O'Clock. Um, and this set, for some reason, it's a lot thicker. So I guess that you get two of each too. Yeah, you get two of each just like Afternoon Walk. And this one is called Sold Mates. I, again, I forgot to look up to see what the collection look like. But look how cute. And my daughter, who's a teenager, is um, love purple. So it's like, 
it's just perfect for if I'm gonna do anything for her and and her friends during this time. And look how stunning these these florals are. So you get again two sheets of each of, and my daughter got long hair and black black hair, so that's perfect. I can always color this, or this can be one of her friends. I don't think she has any blonde girlfriend that are close. They're all dark hair, so I can color them. And then the back, the, see, this is so much easier to cut out too, right? And if you need to. Then you have all these cute little accessories. She just got her first hat about a month ago to wear for Halloween. Oh my gosh, it was, she, they, they found a really like, a little bit sexy hat. Um, there you go. Oh, that's the idea you already seen. And then, I don't know, is it easier for you to see this side or this side? Probably this. And I got some here with school bags. My daughter wear uniform to go to school. So that looks very uniformy. Is that a word, uniformy? Look at these cute little landline telephone in pink. Oh my gosh, what, and what is that? Oh, um, oh my God, what do, you, what do you call these? Like a cassette thingy? <coughs> There's a name. What is the name of this? Um, where well, we used to carry them and we play cassette tapes in them, but they're, that was like portable. It was, was so fancy to actually have that. And these now look at these laptop and so on. I love the window. And then here, oh yeah, she loved to sing. She doesn't play the, doesn't play the violin, but she loved to sing. So there you go. And then here's some more musical instrument. This is, isn't this gorgeous? I couldn't believe it. It was like $7. It was the whole set. So stunning. Normally these are at least 10. The, uh, remember the Stamperia one I show you? That was $10, nine eighty five or something. It's been got some ballet girls in here. And she did play, no, she never played um, soccer. But so cute. And even some ballet costume here, like a little girlish, got some, <laughs> would that be awesome? Some purple and pink basketball. Oh my gosh. Look at the cute gym bag. I love this so much. Then they threw in just a few floral because we need floral always, right? There you go. Oh, so worth the seven bucks. Couldn't believe it. Um, if you need to know if you um i don't know if i'll have time to put these down below i i think i will i, I should have the address of this um etsy seller there she probably still have them because i got these not too long ago this one is also the soulmate collection but this is focused on the women not the teens this one is teenagers yeah and this one is women and look how gorgeous that is too oh my gosh so the same flowers so you can actually take the flowers from the teens collection and use it in here because you know it's they don't need all those kind of the dark i love the burgundy flowers and stuff but for them they don't need it and look at this call me <laughs> this little phone booth that we no longer have so sad and then look at these beautiful girls picking flowers or whatever uh, there oh they, that's 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 the side that's i think a little bit easier to see yeah, I flip it. I guess I flip it to the other side. Okay, when I pick it up, I'll just flip it over. Look at this one. Oh, stunning. Oh my gosh. Just gorgeous. And you got some girls now. They're standing. Whoopsie. Oh, they're still sitting here. In gorgeous colored dresses and skirts, right? And here's these. So pretty. Going to the market, buying some flowers. And then we got, yep, a lot of flowers buying. <laughs> I guess, what else can they have them do, right? Gorgeous dark hair. And then more of those flowers that we really like. Stunning, right? And then now more, more women. Again, looking at flowers, observing. 
inspecting the flowers and then now some hats on the wall and stuff some ba water basin just stunning images oh gorgeous and then the last two are these a little even basket where you can go to the market with and so on isn't that gorgeous seven dollars i gotta find out if she has more and just buy more give away um okay and then i got um this one i got from artisan boutique as well this was the the main one i got along with these the painted by the wind i got from someone else before i don't even remember who um and these were also very inexpensive i can't remember how much but again you only get six pieces of paper i think it was like eight bucks this one is called vintage love and it's absolutely stunning they even show you the paper on the front see how gorgeous and then they always have tags of some sort in the in the front i wish it was different than just tags but i guess that's easy and then look how gorgeous this these flowers are it's far away close up still plenty of room for you to do stuff in and just oh this remind me of the 49 and market collection serenity or serenity recently or something like that look at this oh oh my gosh so pretty see it's like how do you use these things it's so pretty look how this stunning 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 and then even this is gorgeous look at that oh this kind of doesn't belong there even i know that some of these is a little darker but it should at least have it like that you know that's kind of weird that doesn't quite go and that paper with the, like this you know this kind of looked like the first paper but it's different paper number six and that yeah so i'm sorry you guys messed up on this one paper right here this does not belong in there okay and then um these i got these are now i'm going to into studio light the studio light collect collection i got from hsn i think oh my god i can't even remember i think at the end of last year and i kind of put it on the side and i completely forgot to show it to you i, I actually for some i buy so much from hsn that many times i don't even show you guys because you're probably going to yell at me <laughs> or something but i got this and i i'm going to zoom it in a little bit because this is stunning and it's still available i just checked this morning before i i do the video um it's 16 dollars. it's absolutely gorgeous it's all about creating and stuff like that and it's um it's a little die cut book you have to cut it out yourself but it does come with 10 double-sided paper no 10 to each of 10 paper okay and oh actually no you don't even have to cut it out these just pops out they're already die cut for you but look how gorgeous this is you guys oh my gosh it has stuff like even lipstick and things it's gonna be okay oh I've got a, a um, what do you call it, embroidery hoops and even a happy planner, kind of, the wrong kind of, of um, what do you call those, clips, whatever. But look how cute that is, right? So you get two of that with a, look at that little milk, milk carton. Isn't that so cute? Oh my gosh. So you get two of each, so you get there and... And you get, look at this. So you get the happy mail thing there. Got some glue bottles. The Starbucks latte with whipped cream girl boss. Oh my gosh, isn't this just absolutely stunning? Right? Even the cassette tape, the phone. And then you get more of the same gorgeousness. Can you stand it? oh my gosh it's like look, look more pink pink um whatchamacallit typewriter you get 10 different ones two of each i love this 16 bucks for for 10 sheet that's only a dollar 60 a sheet but you get two sheets so it's like 80 cents a sheet of this so worth it the art is just so worth it and you say 16 dollars seems like a lot but you can't that that's cheaper than dollar tree 
um, stickers or die cut, right? Because their sheet is not as big as this. And it's not as pretty either. So gorgeous. If you can dream it, you can do it. Today is going to be great. And then you, oh, actually in the back they have paper. So it's not all die cut pages, but still, that's what the, so what they say. Yeah. Um, I don't remember how many die cut page. So you got one, two, three, four, five, six, six die cut page and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And ten. Okay, six die cut page and ten pattern paper. Wow. Okay. So it's a lot more than twenty pages. And you get some more gorgeousness. Oopsie. Girl boss. I love that so much. Okay, and then look at the paper. I mean, these are, I'm gonna turn it sideways. These are um, what do you call it? A4s, which is like eight and a half by eleven almost. Eight and a half by twelve, even like eight by twelve, and it's big enough that you and you get two pieces each, and the the back is just a plain whatever. You can even uh you know put make a twelve by twelve out of it if you really wanted to, and it's got some a lot of different icons here, and that's the back. This one's just some pretty cute little house plants, and the back is gray, light gray. Then you got the coffee one. Is that great? And the back is the coffee color, matches the coffee mug there. And then you got the desk with the typewriter and stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna try to do this maybe easier for me. There, and then the back is that beautiful turquoise. See, people should really make it sideways, guys. And then it's the, the pattern paper, and the back is like a a light, very light peach cream, almost like ivory. Um, this is almost look like a court board with the border of flowers on the back, and the back is pink. Then you got some mini rainbows paper, and the back is peach. Then this gorgeous um, planner paper, whatever planner, scissors and stuff, and the back is like a, a light. Um, white brick wall whitewash brick wall okay and then i know that's kind of hard to see i love this page i wish i wish it was a little bit bigger um but that's a nice background to do coffee stuff on coffee in the back is a, that beautiful pink that matched the paper perfectly isn't that awesome i love 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 this okay then the last um three collection our studio light collection i got one and these were all 1250 free free shipping um, this one is called Let It Snow, and actually I love it. I saw it on online, and I just, it's very easy to use, you know, just an image on the, in the back here, and then the rest is blank, but the image is really pretty. Here's the image. This is the back of the paper. You get two sheet each, and look at that beautiful wreath and the, the, um, the red robin, and then here's the cute little foxy. I guess I zoom in too much now. I can't even go down far enough for you to see the whole paper. Here's that. Okay. And it, up close, it's really cute. The fox. And then there's the um, photo of the red car with the tree on the front. And then you got that little cute house in the middle of nowhere. That's scary to live like that, to live that far away from everybody. But I guess... If you do that, you're used to it, you know? And look how cute that little squirrel. He's eating the berries. Oh, and this got, wow, that's a beautiful background paper of, of um, pine trees with that cute little deer. What do you call these guys? Not deer. The male version is called something. Anyway, right smack in the middle. And there's some more snowy scene with the house in the middle of nowhere again. That's a Noel. Oh, by the way, that remind me. Okay, what is, which letter is missing from the Christmas alphabet? I just gave you a humongous, let's look at this uh, cut apart. This is not already die cut, so you have to die cut these out. But these are beautiful um die cut to cut out and then the back is just green so which letter in the christmas alphabet is missing noel <laughs> yes 
You get it? No L. So there's no L in the Christmas alphabet. When I um, told it to my family recently, nobody got it. The kids don't even, my kids don't even know that Noel is Christmas in French. Oh, well. So anyway, they still didn't get it even after I explained. I was like, what? My husband finally got it. But it's just like, you guys, just no uh, sense of humor whatsoever. This one is super gorgeous too. Oh my gosh. This is called Take Me to the Ocean. Also by um, Studio Light. Also um, $12.50. And look at this wagon. I just bought a collection, remember, from... Um, so this, this, you get this... You get, yeah, you, same thing. You get two piece of six design, two, um, two separate one. So here's the front, got that beautiful Volkswagen, and then here's the back. So you know what? I don't know why I do that. I guess it's easier, but anyway, here's the back with the surfboard. And then here's the beautiful underwater scene with that seahorse. And here's the back, oh my gosh. Yeah, I was just going to cover this and just use it as a gorgeous sunset or sunrise image of the ocean. Oh, and here's the gorgeous whatever little gate to paradise, right? And then look at that. It's almost like, it's almost like um, it's watercolor, like, you know, it's so pretty. And here, oh, look, your, here's your house open it and you just walk right out to the ocean it's not stunning oh my gosh i you know i've always romanticized the idea of living in by the ocean but i know it's a pain in the ass because you get salt it's your your stuff get rusted and everything else but the idea of sleeping to the sound of the ocean is just so nice and you know going out having coffee in the morning and stuff like that is so nice so pretty but you know once in a while when we do that on vacation i guess that's enough look how cute this is surf spot sunrise paradise island and that scary octopus that's why i eat them i like to eat octopus that's that's like fried calamari i guess squid octopus whatever and that's sweet little oh whoever is there fell off fell overboard and then here's the cut apart page gorgeous flower there some surf gear and the back is just this beautiful pink okay and then the last collection i got from zeo light i got from hsn i believe most of these are still available online i think um uh, the first one may be gone. This one is stunning. It's called Write Your Story. And this is the one by Janine Mindful Art Collection. She She's kind of like a um, one of the designer on the Zero Light team. And her, her stuff is like super special. It's even prettier. But look how gorgeous this is. Again, right? The cute typewriter and what's it say type on it is love 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 in the shape of a heart stunning and the back is a little bit boring there but that's okay and this is the front i don't know why i thought that was easier to flip it already but no that's i think more confusing for me and that's beautiful paper it's almost on like a accounting paper you know what do you call those um yeah, when you do accounting on it, like this is a receipt. And then this stunning um, background here on a book. Look at that. Write your story. Wait a second. And then the back is a beautiful stack of books. On top of just some writing. Yeah. And then we got some more beautiful, stunning stuff. Icon, feathers, and dry leaves, and things like that. That's just so romantic. And then you got the, the wax melt, and some more diary books and stuff. Just gorgeous. And this one, I'm gonna do it upside down. This one got the typewriter. <laughs> even got that looks like a milk 
Doesn't it look like a milk bottle? But it says Sears Robux on it. It's cough medicine. <laughs> That's funny. That's really funny. Stunning, right? And then the back is this. I don't know what it is. Whatever. And we're going to use the front. And again, I don't know how I flip this upside down. But here's this. Got Look at that coffee with the heart in the middle. Just beautiful stuff. And here's the last page. Got the beautiful... You can smell the candle from here, huh? Look at that. Oh, so gorgeous. I hope you guys enjoy that. It's kind of nice when it's a, a few different... Um, um, designers and things like that but in any case I hope you guys are doing great if you like the content and the way I present some of my stuff please hit like or consider subscribing to my channel still trying to reach a thousand subscriber and um, I hope you have a wonderful time and go craft something do something nice to someone you love or maybe even a complete stranger we'll talk to you soon bye